Hi everyone, and welcome to the base game all achievement speed run. Now this is the full VOD, so uh, I'm going to kick off, uh, jump in. So playing survival, I already have a seed, so I'm going to jump straight to that. I don't think it's the best seed, but we're going to go with it. Um, normal game settings, and uh, let's jump in. Uh, what I can do as well is quickly for you guys flash up the the challenge rules um, for you on here. So. Uh, it's quite lax. I mean, there's not a, a, this isn't an official record attempt or anything like that. There isn't really a leaderboard for only. So, you know, it, it's any mod you want as long as it's not too broken. Um, base game and to get all the 33 non timed achievements. Uh, so, not including turn of the century or one year to be exact because those are just time based anyway. Uh, and no cheating, basically. And if you want to have a go at this, then uh, by all means, uh, have a go yourself and you can post on the discord so i'm trying to run this as a community challenge as well i haven't got any takers yet but we need to give it a go ourselves uh right so what i'm going to do i am using dgsm here so the dupe uh, duplicate generation settings mod so i can um i can make these whatever i want so we can uh, we do that say so i'm allowing that it's up to you if you want to use it or not uh, i am just going to use it for the um for the starting dupes not for the um not for the the printing pod ones. I think that's a bit cheaty. Oh, again, if you really wanted to, you could. I mean, you can always do the save reload trick. So it's a thing. Um, overlay is still up. Yes, it is. Thank you. Sorry, not so good with overlays here. But anyway, there you go. You can uh, add a read of that. Ooh, double clicked it. Brilliant. So let's have a look at these. Um, now, one of the huge mistakes I made last time was not giving them, uh, not having a an engineer anywhere near quick enough that kind of screwed all my ranches up so it's just thinking we need a scientist in fact uh, i'm just wondering if we want uh, do we want a triple so we need a scientist i really i should have i should have given this some more thought shouldn't i um <laughs> uh yeah so let's go researching researching um do we need anything else i just wonder if you go for a single dupe you can do a lot of let's just uh, Sorry, I should have I should have really thought about this a bit beforehand, shouldn't I? There we go. Right, we'll go researching. I'm not sure what order these are in. Um, we will take uh, increased science, negative trait, and uh, something that doesn't really matter. Yeah, it's a bit OP. Oh, um, yeah, I, I I I go with pliers. To be honest, I couldn't play without pliers at this point. I did it just. I don't like not having pliers. I can try a sparkle streaker. That sounds uh, not too useful. Let's go with the yodeler. That's the one I wanted. Um, awesome. So we got a uh, a researcher. We need a digger and we need an engineer. I think so. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go for a double. Um, that seems good. And we're going to go for uh, building and digging. And a positive trait is going to be we can have the level one level one digging skill that'll get us through some granite early on which is great uh just gonna not roll past it again just already went past it once that's the one uh decreased yeah kitchen menace that's fine uh, da -da. uh ugly cry is definitely the best one of those we'll have sparkle streaking and in terms of the last one so we need an engineer so that's going to be suit wearing and operating are the two we want so let's get a double dupe and go with okay we got operating with suit wearing uh, they're also going to need to be our pilot i suppose hmm okay could be our pilot we'll see uh can we start with mechatronic engineering is that a thing i swear that was a thing which is pretty broken to be honest super duper crop tending critter ranching Art, art, suit training, mechatronic. They can start with mechatronic. I mean, that seems that seems a bit broken. And uh, I, uh, t are you going with T RAM, Tyram, or T One RAM? Uh, whichever you want. Uh, let me know. But welcome in, welcome in. Uh, right, uh, something not bad here. Sure, that, and then there's. Uh, Sparkle streaker. Uh, yeah, DGSM's been seems to be fine for me, so I'm good. 
I don't know. Yeah, I, I know people have some issues with it, but I did before. It's on the latest version, and it seems fine. Um, so this is the both go speed run. Uh, this is actually attempt number three, so let's let's go with that. Um, let's jump in. Okay, so we're on this seed. I did have this seed before, and um, I can't remember. So <laughs> I think we need to go up. Well, obviously, we need to go up to space. I can't remember where the ammo suits were, or roughly what my plan was for actually building this base out. So, um, right, let's uh, let's get that going. And then I think uh, we'll start. So we'll stick some research and stuff in here. We could put some beds there. Maybe do we toilet here? It rolled until one bill. Yeah, I mean, exactly, Mippa. If you if you choose them right, you. you it's quite a big boost, isn't it? So let's put that on triple speed and uh, let's pop this up as well. Uh, so we'll already get that going. Where can we put that? I suppose that's the best we're going to manage. So uh, uh, I think we'll just put the bathroom over here, shall we? I mean, why not? So let's do three outhouses. Um, Let's get that built. Awesome, and hi, uh, Ren, Rani, Ranio, 007. Oh, come in, come in. Uh, we are, yeah, we're going to go for bed and bath. That's the first one, obviously. Shouldn't be too surprising. Uh, we'll go up here and we can dig the oxalite. We know that now. <laughs> it was, uh, yeah, got to learn that one. Uh, we don't need to do that. And then we'll chuck some beds up there and grab the metal ball. Um, yeah, welcome in everyone. We're doing base game all achievement speed run. So uh, we are. Uh, we can already get to that. Trying to see how quickly we can do this. Uh, you got kind of wheezy most times and <laughs> running out of power before getting to the long ones. Well, it, if you manage to do carnivore, you are. You. you you're pretty much all the way there from a all achievement perspective. Uh, there isn't any one that's more uh, more challenging than that. So as long as you don't uh, do the super sustainable incorrectly, you should be fine. Um, and hi, zip zip, sir, sir, kid, sir, kid. Apologies if I get names wrong. It's uh, not always obvious. Hey, so yep. Yeah. Hopefully we should get bed and bath. Um, uh, so this is this is basically I'm saying any seed. Uh, you can use any seed you want. It's not there's no uh, there's no specific one. Awesome, we've got bed and bath. So that's uh, number one. Easy within the first cycle. Game any power posts? Oh well. Hmm. In which case, I think you just need to have a look at sustainable uh, power sources. Oh, I don't know why that's there. That's not right. Um, okay, what we also need to do is get the research station going. That's why I'm keen we dig around in here. Though we're probably going to lose the room bonus. Uh, yeah, so I don't get on petroleum boilers, solar panels, um, natural gas vents, use just bombs. Da -da -da. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure we're going to lose a room bonus here, but anyway. Do, do, do. Um, we can dig that out. That's going to be the toilet. Thank you for the follow. Do Doomsday? I'm going with Doomsday. That seems like you've, you're aiming for that. Um, yeah, the material production. Exactly. It does help with super sustainable, sure. Have we lost the room bonus? Uh, not surprisingly, we have. So, yeah, we're going to get on with that. Uh, and then what we'll do is we'll chuck the research station down here and we'll start doing some power i think uh yeah i just think we should light this up so uh, we'll just do one battery for now shall we and we'll root it like that Ooh, oh dear that's not going well uh, and we'll just up the priority on those uh, this isn't the testing branch. It's in the testing branch. And now, uh, IS6 Havoc K9. Um, welcome in. Uh, yeah, so, so the video on the, the GeoTuner, 
I basically had to rewrite the entire thing or, or a lot of it because it was broken and you could do whatever you wanted. You could have as many on the same geyser. Uh, and then they changed it. So <laughs> I had to re-script it and now I'm going to have to re-record everything. That plus the fact that I rebuilt my whole computer has delayed me in making videos a bit. So, uh, yes, it, it should be coming at some point, I promise. Um, but yeah, for those of you that don't know, so the I've updated the CPU and RAM and motherboard. You now I've had to reinstall my entire hard drive, which is a pain. Obviously, copied all the data across, but still a pain. Um, uh -huh. Let's go up. Uh, we should start building up. Um, this is a most use records in part two. Yes, exactly. So, yeah, the, the most use is the series we're doing on every every Friday. This is kind of a bit of a special time, just an odd odd stream. Uh, we should probably be doing this guy, shouldn't we? Let's get the uh, let's get the power going. Ignore the rest. Uh -huh. I'm struggling to keep up with chat and focus on this, so <laughs> bear with me, guys. But yes, uh, yes, we've updated the hardware, uh, and you will see the difference in the most used record attempt. So we have we are up to playable levels of FPS, which is awesome. So I can't wait to show you guys that on on Saturday. Obviously, we just started a new game, so the FPS is more than fine anyway. Uh, we should probably get some oxygen going, shouldn't we? So it's been a little while since I started a new uh, a new game, so. Um, Forgive me if I'm out of practice. <laughs> Just ignore chat. But I can pause it. I can pause it to uh, keep you guys going. I mean, uh, why are you digging the oxalite? So because... Um, oh, thank you for the follow, uh, Rain. So if you if you leave the oxalite, it only off-gasses into half the mass anyway. So if you dig it, then you lose half the mass, but it off-gasses into the same amount. So that is why... Uh, that's why you can leave it. Sorry, leave it. You, that's why you can dig it. You don't need to leave it. You don't lose any oxygen. Uh, you will lose some oxalite, but that's fine. So, uh, skills. We don't have any skills yet. I'm jumping ahead. Uh, priorities. Definitely Joshua should be doing that. Awesome. And I don't like playing with the priorities too much other than that, because it can get them off doing what they're meant to be doing. Uh, let's get the oxygen built. And then... Keep going up. Yeah, exactly. You don't lose any oxygen, so that's great. So we've got basic farming. Okay, good. Uh, not that we can actually do any farming yet. Uh, then what I also want to do is lay out the base. So, it's, um, pause a sec just to count this out. So we should have a 16. That should be it. And then the door should be here. And then we'll uh, ladder down here. Was that right? I'm losing track of the counting. Six, fifth, 16 door, ladder pole. Awesome. I'll just lay this out so we know what's going on. Ladder pole. And then we'll put uh, eight, eight docks per uh, go. So we're, we're planning Atmo soup docks in. We'll put a door here and then uh, we'll ladder here. So that seems to be the plan. Awesome. Yeah, exactly. It does slow it down, but that's not a major issue. So let's get that done. Uh, bump priority on that. See if we can get the room bonuses back. Not that we need them urgently, but it's always nice to have them. We'll just fill up with oxygen. And then we can start uh, digging out there. Uh, yeah. And then uh, we should probably capture this. So what do do? So the wall goes here, doesn't it? This is actually one tile too big. I can't really get <laughs> yeah, that. One to the side for the dock and door. Yeah. Um, so, uh, so ladder pole, eight here, eight here. There's not going to be a door on the left side. There's no need for that. Uh, and then one door for the outer base and we'll put some insulation in there and, and go up. So this is going to be the main shoot. We'll go up and we primarily need to go up. Uh, and this is base game Oceana, yes. So this is the base game all achievement speed run. I think if we did the if we did the spaced out DLC all achievements speed run, it would take quite a while. Particularly with mine the gap and uh GMOA okay, those both take so long. 
uh, and hi Elio. Uh, it was kind of planned. I mean, I put a I put an announcement out yesterday on the Discord, so I, I pinged you. You gotta you gotta watch your pings. But yes, somewhat planned. <laughs> Awesome. So I'm thinking what we can do is uh, just dining dining room in here. Um, I mean, why not? Um, we don't have we don't have the water cooler yet. Okay. Oh, the plant. Oh, the decontamination one. Yeah, that was the one, wasn't it? Uh, we can we can we do that? I don't know. Uh, or just just. Oh dear. <laughs> that did the opposite of what we wanted. Uh, yeah. So just disable disinfect because it doesn't actually do anything. As long as they wash their hands, they're fine. So let's do that. I don't know if that's copyable. Is that copyable? No. Great. Thank you. Thank you, game. Is there any? If there is an easy way, please do that. <laughs> oh, you got to clear your pings out there, Leo. That's, uh, that's on you, that one. Uh, right. Let's just bump that a little bit. Get the bedroom bonus bonus back. Meanwhile, uh, research continues. We can stick a flower pot in there. Yeah. Just grab some more copper. Uh, and then we'll get the... <laughs> under the germ layout. Yeah. Oh. Ah, there we go. Automatic. Right, got it. They're saying you wanted eight docks. Oh, I forgot to add the checkpoint spot. Thank you. Yeah, sorry. You guys are right. There you go. Thank you for reminding me. Otherwise, it would have been a bit awkward. Yeah, we'll sort that out once we've got some airflow tiles. So let's get a. We'll grab the automation. Although, not that really we need the automation wise immediately because we can't even build a gold generator. So, uh, yeah. You better just focus on digging this out and. Uh, what we can also do is prepare for the fourth dupe. Hopefully we should have the latrine in there, barracks, of course. Um, things looking good. Right, next dupe in and we want a rancher. I see plus husbandry, minus husbandry. <laughs> kind of that's plus six net, and that's kind of what we want. Um cuisine, exhibition. We will need a cook too. Ooh, and it has man, the storing's really annoying. Construction. Yeah, Jean's quite good actually, except for the snoring. Maybe we just give her our own bed. Then we took it plus husbandry. That's what's that plus three? He's got plus six. And the decor. Eh. I feel like Jean's too good here. Oh, what am I meant to be realising now, Horio? Come on, help me out, help me out. Right, we'll take Jean, we'll take Jean, but what we'll do is... Um, put the bed over here and we'll leave a gap, right? So then she isn't uh, waking up. <laughs> Would you... Well, yeah, so I, I, I'm doing ten tasks at a time, you can't... The, the, this will be speedy, will be speedy. I know I normally play that way anyway, as you guys know my regulars. Um yeah, we, we don't slow down. <laughs> we, we just we just go. Even when we're doing most dupes, that's uh, yeah. Try and get all the buried stuff dug up because we need a bris in the bluff briar, that's the one, so let's grab that. <laughs> so we can plant it. Um Gotta get that built and then door there. If, if I've missed something, please tell. <laughs> please tell me, otherwise I'm gonna gonna get very lost. Uh, the, the, the advantage of doing it with chat, of course. Cool. cool. Uh, what should be good? Yeah, so just poor, poor old jeans on the floor currently, which is so hot. Uh, we'll just double check my achievements because we... I think we're good. I haven't pressed any dodgy buttons this time to make sure they're still enabled. Good. <laughs> yeah, we're playing at much more reasonable speed this time, so happy with that. Right, have a briar seed here. 
And we should get the employment. That gives us the water cooler. Let's get that built. And that will give us the... Uh, that gives us the Great Hall. Uh, we can disable that. Awesome. And the latrine is... Not done. We've got a snorer. I know I've got a snorer. I, I took one. I, I saw it. That's why I've give I've give Jean this bed on the end, and I'll leave a gap, so she's fine. She, she just has the best stats. So, uh, on that topic, we get a skill point. So always best to take the rancher uh, here, unless you well, unless you spec them anyway. So we're gonna need a rancher to start ranching. Mm -hmm. Uh. If you're asking about CPU optimization overclocking, I haven't done that yet. No, I'm just kind of left it. Uh, say the it's overclocked out the box, so I'm, we'll run it. We'll see if we need some more. Uh, now, where are we going next? This is the question. What do we want? We want the spawn, really. I think so. You know, we should just do everything to get the spawn up. Uh, is there anything else we need immediately? The airflow tiles, don't we? So let's grab the airflow tiles. Um. That will also allow us to put a, a, a supercomputer in. So let's do do that. Uh, I wonder if we move this one over. Do it? No, that's fine. But then what else we want to do is put a light in here just to, just to cover this off. Uh, we'll run that. Uh, I think we'll just get the research bonus, the light. Productivity bonus, we'll take that, uh, suppress that, get rid of that notification, I hate that one. Um, yeah, and then we need to get digging really, so uh, I can see that that is a problem, so let's, uh, let's build that quickly, make sure we don't get anyone stuck. Mm -hmm. Lots of food. <laughs> no, it's it. so I have run on the most dupes record base. Uh, on triple speed, it's getting about 15, four, well, sorry, 13 FPS, which is, you know, it, it's definitely playable. And on, on one and two times speed, it is, it's pretty smooth. It's like 20 plus, so it doesn't look laggy at all to me. I know it's not great, but it's a 2D sandbox game. So, yeah, when you see, I, I, I can have a look at the end of the stream, or uh, you can have a look on Saturday, but it's so much better. So the, uh, yeah, the real, the extra horsepower really helped, which is great. Um, right, let's have a have a dig through these. <laughs> yes, well, right, thirteen is not smooth. It's a little bit choppy, but it's it's definitely playable. It's so much better than than it is currently. So you know, I was getting six, and it was slideshow slideshow central. <laughs> so we're beating that. Um, cool. Uh, pressure management. So what we can do is I'll do my normal setup to three. For this is how I do my airflow tiles, and then this just helps the oxygen pop through. Um, mm -hmm. uh, that's there. Oh, not there. Hopefully, we've got enough copper. It's it's nice having enough metal ore to actually build stuff. You know, that's uh, not worrying about it. it. Feels a bit new. Uh, so we'll do that. Um, and hi, hi, fat man. Uh, so we're going for speed run of all achievements in the base game. That is the goal here. So that's the theme. So um, what else do we need? So I think we're just going spawn. We go spawn next. So we're better off. Oh, we need ranching too, but I don't think we need ranching urgently. So let's crack on with that. Uh, all right. Yeah. Thanks for popping in, Horror. Good to see you as always. Uh, hopefully I'll catch you soon. Uh, yeah. So we'll get these airflow tiles in. Then, in terms of base layout, so we've got the generic room bathroom. I'm kind of thinking we do the good old, uh, we, we make us kind of 48, uh, sorry, <laughs> that's all right. We're trying to make a 48 dupe base. I think that's the goal. I'm going to try and take every dupe I can get. That's going to be the goal. Um, so in terms of floors, just roughly plan this out because we need the... We need the ranches in here too. We can put them higher up because it's a bit, a bit hotter up there. So we can run this up. Uh, try and find some more hatches. That's always good. Uh, this is that is real reachable, which is good. So if we've got, 
uh, we've got like a, a generic room here which can turn into a kitchen slash research just whatever we've got bathroom one mess hall we can put a second mess hall and go go far left if we have to we've got bedroom let's say bedroom and then I probably what need another two layers of bedrooms I think to, in order to take 48 although do we I think it might be better to ah oh, no hold on a minute I haven't quite thought about this because this right side has to be now 64s. Uh, expected cycle count. My goal is getting under 200 cycles. That's the goal. Um, if we can get Carnivore on, I think we've got a chance. So that's we go. Okay, so we're going to go bedrooms on the right, and we want uh, six bedrooms. Anyway, we can we can work that out later. I think the point is we're going to have mess hall, mess hall, and then we'll just stick the ranches on the right hand side. So uh, just in terms of numbers, there can be hatch arches. We're going to go 25. That will be the one. Uh, and then we'll stick three hatch arches down there. I think we're going for three, three hatch arches. We are motoring through this research. That is monstrously quick. Uh, if that's, what do you mean no researchers are started? I, I know, I don't have one. You think about 100. What? Well, I mean, yeah. I don't think 100 is possible. Doing doing 100 with Carnivore and Super Sustainable and then also launching rockets. And bear in mind, right, so I think the longest one here is um, getting all the critters tamed because we need to go to space to get a Gassy Moo. So I think the Gassy Moo, getting a Gassy Moo back and taming it and meanwhile doing all the other challenges, I, I think 100 is, un, is not doable. I, I really don't think it is. 150, maybe. But that is, that, that's a lot. I mean, I think 200 is a lot, to be honest. So, uh, yeah, th this challenge was much harder than I expected when I when I tried it. So, uh, there you go. So, we're going to do that across there. Um, and in terms of, uh, these, these are nine, aren't they? So, uh, I think we can do that. We'll do something like this. Way up for suits, awesome. Uh, yeah, exactly. Shows how to build a spawn, yeah, absolutely. Smiley, I mean, the spawn is is one of the big goals here, so we'll get uh, actually got to change the research at night because I still don't have a uh, still don't have the skill yet. Um, yeah, absolutely. We're gonna do a I think we're gonna do a full Rodriguez to start and put it in, so we will be building a spawn. Do not worry about that. Now, I think what we can also do is collect these water sources together because we're going to have to go into here and it'd be good to have more space. Yeah. Um, but yeah, if you haven't, Smiley, have you seen the Oxygen Tutorial Bite? Because that covers everything you need about bombs. So. You can do that. Uh, well, that gives you the full explanation. I'll do, I'll do my best to do it as we go along. But uh, yeah, it's primarily this is a... This is a speed run rather than a tutorial, but I'll, I'll do my best to explain it as we're going along. Um, should be better if... Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but the, so the spawn also provides loads of power, so we're fine. <laughs> okay, well, I, you know... I, there, there isn't that much to it, it other than building the design as I as I showed it. So, if you've got the blueprint, then uh, that should give you most of what you need. Also, I see hatches here. Uh, we will have to um, put a floor in here. So we'll put we'll start putting ranches up there. So we need to build that out, and we also need to get our way across here. Uh, let's do that. The, yes, so the meteors, the meteors are going to be interesting. Um, I was kind of having to think about whether it's worth doing a proper setup or just trying to kind of wing it through. Uh, oh, we have skills. It didn't tell me I have skills. That's very annoying. Also, we've already got Mechatronics Engineering, so I don't think we need the other stuff here, do we? Because we usually just get the other ones to get that. Uh, now, uh, annoyingly, she can't be. Oh, oh, that's really bad, isn't it? Did I do that? Yoko, ah, uh, whoops. Okay, that's a bit of a mistake there. Anyway, um, yeah, don't do that, guys. If you're going to make a pilot, 
make sure you don't give them yokel. Uh, or you might have to make Joshua the pilot, but that's fine anyway. Uh, cool, we can do digging. Awesome, so now we can get the level two ones. So spawn wise, uh, we need to grab, we need the insulated tiles, we need a lot of this stuff. We don't need that, we do need the pump. And we need, uh, I don't know, what do we need of this? Let's grab the electrolyzer, obviously, that's a good one. Yeah, 15 tons of steel for the monument is going to be, it's going to be a bit, it's going to be quite a bit. Uh, we can, but we should have some oil biomes, so I think we're, we'll be alright on that, in terms of getting the lime out from fossil. And we just got to find some iron, so. Not too worried. Uh, have we drowned a hatch in there? I hope we haven't. I think we might have done. Da, da, da. We, will need, we will need someone with the grilling skill, too. Hmm. Yeah, it used to give you a notification in the top left, for sure, but I don't think we've done that now. So and so gained a skill point. Yeah, anyway, uh, we should be on for taking our next dupe now. So I'm going to try and keep taking a dupe every every cycle. So I think that, uh, that should be the quickest way to get this done. Uh, and having seen the 50-50 challenges, I mean, you can definitely have that many dupes early, you just need enough infrastructure. Um, agriculture, oof. Athletics, ouch. Hard digging, that's it. Hard digging and husbandry, I mean, why not? Um, so let's make a second rancher, go with that. So, yeah, we need to get cracking with going up over here and just fleshing out the rooms for the ranches. I suppose we need to start researching the ranching. Um, I, yeah, I, I am wondering now, on, on reflection, whether taking a rancher like uh, really early on is a better idea. I don't know. Um, so let's... Let's pop this in. Uh, we don't have the station yet, do we? But we're going to do... So we need a station, feeder, a drop-off, and then we'll do the door trick. Good old door trick. Or is this... Oh no, hold on, hold on. This is going to be the other... Um, this is going to be the other mess hall, or great hall. So we'll leave that for now, because that's slightly less important. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I don't think there is anything that we haven't mentioned. I mean, Carnivore, Locavore and Super Sustainable are really the hard three. As soon as you get those, you are you should be somewhat on, on easy street. Um, or, or at least there's there's no time limit or any, you know, urgency after that. I think you're you're okay. Right. Uh, yeah, so I mean, effectively, let's get the ranches set up. And uh, then we can, we can work it out from there. Yeah, there might. Yeah, there are some that take a while, so that's going to be uh, that. Those are the ones that are going to slow me down on the speed run. Um, getting the gassy move, getting into space. We need we need to get into rocketry and space quickly, um, for sure. Taming all the critters is definitely one that is 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 going to take a while. Two. So uh, how far are we off? Critteraching. I mean, you don't need to start critteraching that soon, but there's, who's on it? Uh, Gene's about halfway there. But if you had it right from the start, I mean, you could pretty much get get ranching right away, so that'd be way quicker. Maybe there's a benefit there. You can get carnivore a bit quicker, and then you can kind of focus on other stuff. I think that's a benefit. Um, not once. Yeah, exactly. All right. Well, I, I mean, I'm still keen to see your your times. So even if you're even if you're doing a, uh, just a normal run and you're not particularly speedrunning, I'm still keen to know. So if you're in the Discord, then uh, then definitely pop in there and uh, and let me know how f how quickly you can manage it. Uh, so we're going to go for three in here. So yeah, basically, there's just a lot of digging to do. Um, which is why... I think having well having diggers at the start is obviously good. I don't think that's a that's a surprise to anyone. But yeah, we can we can go up here. Got a lot of carbon dioxide over there. 
Uh, yes, hydrogen is super sustainable, so definitely you can do that. That's why the um, the spawn is so good. It really helps the super sustainable out. I definitely recommend. I mean, I always recommend getting up early anyway. No, it, it just makes the game a lot easier, but especially when you're doing super sustainable. Okay. So yeah, we'll just get the ladder up here. I think we'll dig out a second one too, just to help the airflow. Uh, the water's not dropped that far. Um, yeah, we might struggle to get a third ranch in there. Um, awesome. No focus. Right, so we got the ranching stuff. We need the incubators too. Okay, well, that's going to be a lot of research. Right, let's get going with that. Uh, yeah, plug slogs. They probably are good, but they're also not in the base game, so <laughs> that, that wouldn't help me. But uh, also, I don't use them very much anyway, even in the DLC. I think I need to have a look at them. Since they, they buff them, there's definitely more incentive to use them, for sure. They are uh, they're much stronger now. But yeah, so they're not in this version of the game, so something we have to worry about immediately. Um, oh, Full research tree shouldn't take that much time anyway. So the rocket part of it will take a while, yes. But then you you need that anyway to get the temporal tear and the gassy moo, I think. So you're, you you need to do the research tree for all of those anyway. Yes, yeah, so we don't have a, um, a rancher yet, but we will do. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So... Because you're running hatch ranches, we don't need the, um, we don't need to worry too much about heat as long as we don't scold the dupes, which is like seventy degrees, uh, we'll be fine. So you can run this base really hot, so way hotter than you'd normally run it with plants. That is a as an advantage. So, well, that snoring really takes a bit of space, doesn't it? And we'll see. We'll see. We'll, we'll keep trying to take dupes. I think. Yeah, food might become an immediate issue. I mean, I suppose what we'd also need is um, micro musha. We should probably get that built just so we don't run out. We can get muckroot, but um, yeah. Uh, let's pop that up. Uh, I just want to get for all of these buried items. Because they could be hatches. So let's have a look for those. Da -da -da. We want as many hatches to start as we can. I wonder if we come in this way. Uh, let's try and do something sensible. Okay. Da -da -da. Uh, yes, we still just need the we need Jean to get on with that. I have to open this up. Add some sand. Uh, we'll try and open this up too, so we've got a bit of airflow. That's nice. Uh, and I, Blood Spartan, oh, thank you for popping in. And yeah, good morning. If it's your morning, it's my afternoon here, but uh, good morning to you. I guess you're over in America ways. Uh, input through the oxygen. Yeah, we yeah we can see we can see about proper cooling. We I suspect we'll need it. We'll need some cooling at some point, <laughs> so we'll have to, have to do that. Uh, but yes, let's keep digging. Make sure it's reachable. Uh, agriculture. Oh, we've dug through some sand there. Yeah, liquid hydro 150. I mean, well, we yeah we probably need to get ahead of that if we want to finish by 100. <laughs> No, if you want to finish by 200, yeah, I suppose. 150 is reasonable. And uh, are you TV, TV Maggle? Magal? Come in. Yeah, so I think we'll just we'll make a big kind of carbon oxide and water pit down the bottom. Uh, just finding, looks like bristle blossom seeds. There's a bit of muckroot there. Muckroot's good too. We'll definitely take the muckroot. And I won't complain about that. Um, yeah, I think we're going full Rodriguez. As I say, I want to take every dupe I can get, and I think building a half Rodriguez is almost slightly counterproductive. I don't, it's not enough oxygen. 
It's only 14 dupes. So I think we've... Yeah. I'm a bit anxious about taking that many dupes, but it's got to be the quickest way, so I think we've got to push ourselves to uh, to do it. Mm -hmm. Still just waiting on Jean. Um, yeah, at this point I'm not worried. I think we're all good. We probably need another oxygen diffuser. Okay, so I suppose we can chuck that in there. Um, yeah, and then we need... Yeah, we're just working on the on researching the incubator. Oh, we need space for the incubators. I suppose for now we could pop them in here. We'll have a lot of... Yeah, it's going to be a while before we fill up this great hall. So let's stick the incubators just below. We can also put them on the right side. Uh, submerged electrolyzers. Um, definitely viable. Uh, there's nothing wrong with them. The, the only reason why I prefer the Rodriguez is that they, they, don't, uh, they don't just run indefinitely. So if you don't need... The oxygen it doesn't run which i see as a benefit so uh you, you can just use up all your water with the the infinite ones so that that's always the case so uh right, we'll set this to eight and we'll grab hatches hatchlings and we'll wrangle those as soon as we can we have ready for mush bars uh, we don't have um, we don't have fridge not another mm. Uh, oh, I did also want to have a look at infinite food storage earlier on. I think that is going to be useful. Uh, try and say, try and get to all these buried objects because they could be hatches. So, see, so we give them a lot to do. They won't be bored, which is good. And then we need to build the spawn. So I'm thinking we just pop the spawn somewhere over here. It's pretty hot over here, though. Could we put it over here? Um, if this is going to be the edge of the base, I think that makes sense. I do need insulated tiles to uh, set this to all. Uh, yeah. Let's get that wire built. Okay. Da -da -da. Yeah, full full sustains thirty, so I need two. But yeah, I'm saying if you build a uh, half one, it only build, it only take fourteen, and then you need to get another one quickly. So the difference between a uh, Half and a full in terms of building it is pretty minimal, so that's why we're going to do that. All right, let's get the insulated tiles, and so we can start laying it out. I think we'll we'll lay it out over here, shall we? Because uh, we'll yeah. Uh, maybe we can come through here. Uh, yeah. But lots of digging to do, really. That's kind of the plan. Find all these buried objects. This should be. We can dig that. Printable is right. You're just going to take more dupes. More dupes. Got more husbandry, strength, science. Plus strength, minus strength. That's fine. I think we take the science, don't we? We can, we can do some more researching with Ruby. So if we give Ruby that and ask her to uh, research, it'd be good. How many unique dupes we got? six now we only have four beds so that's a bit of a uh, bad one also with scheduling we need to start that so now we'll offset these by two this is my normal way of doing it one two down time now we'll leave them on two for now but uh two plus two across we'll put four of them on there because i'm inevitably going to forget about it there we go oh how many unique a total I, I don't know off the top of my head to be honest um if you're on the beta content and you go on the wardrobe then it, that should give you the full list why is there a farm tile here oops uh sure okay Ah, oh, we got outdoor renovations. There you go. I completely missed that one. So there you go. We got outdoor renovations. That's number two. Did it give me an alert for that or not? I didn't. I did not see an alert for that. Weird. Uh, still waiting on Jean. Jean is really the critical one for getting the writing going. Um, Nope. Uh, just got a normal hatch. Okay, what do we 
tape, stick sandstone. Good. <laughs> Thank you, Aridia. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm not going to start renaming them. I'm just going to leave them as is. I'm not sure you want to be. Uh, I'm not sure you want to be in this colony. We'll see. We'll see. It should be all right. Let's. Uh, yeah, hang fire for a bit. We'll. Da, da, da. I'm gonna focus on the game. It's gonna be completely, completely focused on getting this achievement done. Um, yeah, so we're building up here, which is good. The op the carbon dioxide should be falling down. I suppose we can dig our way across here. I hate it when they just dig it and leave it. It's so annoying. Mm -hmm. but, uh, everything seems to be fine currently. All good. Just a bit more research. And then we'll, we'll work out what we're missing for the spawn. I mean, we've got the electrolyzers. I think we need the gas pumps. We we'll probably need a bit more automation too. So, uh, alright, we have the gas pumps. We have the liquid pumps. We have the liquid pumps. I think we just need a bit of automation. So we need the sensors. We need the filter gate. Uh, where's the ammo sensor? Ammo sensor's there. 37. All right, let's go with that. Although the wiki isn't always up to date. So you could be a little bit careful with that. Um, right, we've got igneous rock. So let's assume maybe we have a... Um, we have a ladder pole here, which we could do. We, we could do that. The floor is here. So one, two... Uh, have that three high. I think let's do that. Um, we'll use mesh. We oh sorry, we'll use airflow because we don't have mesh. I'm pretty sure the power goes on the right, although I don't have that. So uh, do we have gold? We have no gold. Uh, right, that's going to be a minor issue. I really want to make it out of gold. Um, so let's see if we can head up here. Um, we want to go up the main shaft. Uh, now what I should do, what I should do is, rather than this, is uh, S-dig it, shouldn't I? So, S-digging is the quickest way to get up. Uh, assuming there's no sand for them to fall over. And we've also got some iron ore here, so that's good. Uh, we also already have um, that. So we're going to S-dig it all the way up like that. Yeah, the the, the, wiki, the wiki is usually... Well, it is really good. It is just not complete. That's kind of the problem. <laughs> hmm. Probably because they keep changing things and they can't keep up. But yeah. So the S-digging pattern is the quickest way to get up there. And then we'll... Yeah, we'll just ladder up here a little bit. Uh, get this stuck out, I think. So, pump, pump, pump. Uh, oh, how many is it? So, four Rodriguez. Um, door. Da, da, da. I think it's this. It's quite big, isn't it? When you're starting out, it looks very big. Ah, I do. A bit of a sand fall there. <laughs> uh, F have impact on the decor. Uh, yes, I think they do. I think they're negative. They're minus five or f minus four point five with copper. But uh, I'm not going to be worrying about decor, to be honest. In this run, did you collect decoration? So yeah, they kind of just absorb the decor that's around them, and it's kind of weighted by the amount of time they spend in each. Uh, amount contributing to an initial rush. Yeah, that's the that's the problem. There's not enough people to uh, sustain it, and, and there's so much that keeps changing. It's, it's difficult to get accurate information as well because the devs don't they don't include it. So it requires like a lot of testing to keep it up to date. Cool. Yep, yeah, we'll start on spawn. Uh, yeah, great. They are going, getting very wet coming down here. If we keep, uh, keep taking water out, this will drain off in the end. Uh, right, now I realised... 
we don't have any of the power stuff, or we have some of the power stuff. No, we never finished the smart battery. Uh, so let's grab the hydrogen generator and the heavy watt wire, so we need both of those. But yeah, this, this S-Dig is a very powerful way of getting up. It's kind of the minimum building. Oh. We have to take that to get out. Gene. Yeah, maybe Gene, you might want to do that for your suffocate. Yeah, and then what you can do is just pop the the ladder in there and also then that leaves materials on the side for you to make the ladder out of so another benefit of doing the stick this way and we can also use granite up here because it's just granite on the floor cool yeah so spawn and exploration we definitely need to get out on the map oh uh, see we really want this gold and we can either use that gold or i think there's some i see polluted water here and gold there awesome we can go grab that we just keep going and we're not going to worry too much about um, oxygen. They're kind of just going to have to lump it, so. Let's see, they'll be breathing chlorine soon. Go straight through this abyssalite. Uh, that water tank's going to be a bit annoying. Get it from where the head is or the whole body? Oh, uh, I am not sure. I think it's usually where the body is. But that's that's a bit of a guess. So don't take that as gospel. No, right. We've got that. Uh, then, yeah. I'm pretty sure. I'm just gonna lay these out because I need to make sure I put the heavy what in the right place. Yeah, it's on. It's on the left. Okay. It's fine. And the electrolyzers. And yeah, if we're doing. Let's just lay out some power here. Uh, so, I hope we've got enough copper. I think we do. Now this goes to the left side. That goes to the right side. Um, uh, right side. Awesome. Okay, get rid of that. Uh, and then we're also going to need a plate in the top. Um, come up here. Da, da, da. Yeah, I don't usually worry about decor too much. I mean, to be honest, most of the time there's generally little difference between where the head and their body is. Um, if you've got a big gradient, it'd be a bit weird. Uh, uh, possible. Uh, so yeah, I'm kind of wondering if masks are the way to go. I don't know. Depends how quickly we can find find some thimble reed, isn't it? Uh, so yeah, then we'll build our power on the top here. Um, hmm. Oxygen's kind of a problem, isn't it? Over here. Thinking, I mean, I'm not really thinking about it. I'm just letting them do it. But uh, if they can't breathe, then building it is going to be a bit of a pain. Uh, we got our skills yet? No, we haven't. Okay, right, we're almost on ranching. Uh, one more tile next to it. Oh yes, thank you. Thank you. Yep. Remember that. Uh, airlock, airlock. That's starting to come together. Uh, we could do. We could do. Probably a sensible, uh, sensible go. They're on sleep now. Uh, yeah, and I don't know what we're doing about the salt water. I mean, I'm guessing we might just have to... We could divert the the tunnel one to the right. I think that's just sensible for now. And probably drain it down to the left. I see there's fossil here too, so... We will be fine on steel, I'm sure. Uh, let's, yeah. Get that built. And do that. Um, and bump this too. Hopefully some options should be getting up here. Uh, we, we are spilling chlorine and stuff out, which isn't ideal, but not the end of the world. Yeah, I think this is sensible, just to... Oh, well, brilliant sound amplifiers. So that gives me the batteries. Um, and then we just need the Atmos... We got the Atmos sensors? I think we did. We need the filter gate. Let's grab that. Uh, we also need some refined metal. Better get on the rock crusher. Uh, I don't really have space for this. I mean, I suppose we can put some stuff down here. 
Um, a bit wet down here though. Uh, you're right through the wall. There isn't really a wall there anyway, is there? Okay. Uh, granite. Uh, let's do that. Yeah, so we got some oxygen down here. There's still carbon dioxide. Uh, kind of need to dig some more holes, don't we? Just kind of wondering if this is a waste of time or actually beneficial. I don't think I have plans to make a room down here, but... Uh, we could dig like that. Just stick some carbon dioxide a bit lower, oxygenate this area. Um, let's just put resources on here. Just keep an eye on dirt. Dirt's always a good one. Algae, copper. That'd be fine. Printable is right. It's table tubes, um, although food is going to start to become an issue. Uh, medicine aesthetic strength. We do need a chef. Uh, I think we just make one of the other ones a chef, can't we? It's going to be a while digging. I mean, Ashcan's definitely the best, huh? Um, I'm pretty sure I can put his bed here and it'll be fine, I think. Uh, yeah. Generic sensors, good. Because research, I mean, if anything, the research is going really quickly. Not an issue. Mm -hmm. So yeah, making good progress up here. I mean, it's cycle twelve. I think we've got quite high in cycle twelve already. We're doing doing a good job. I see cold over here too, uh, which is nice. And a lot of iron uh, and dracos. Do we see a Dracos? I don't know. We could do that. I just want to look at Thimble Reeds. Generally, they're easier. Okay. I wonder also if there's a mop job here that would be helpful. Um, do we have? Awesome. Right, we've got Critter Ranching. Finally, that took a while. Uh, so we're going to need to cook, but let's grab the advanced research. Um, right, now we can just wrangle everything. And who's that? Was Jean. So let's give Jean the ranching priority. There we go. Uh, and then we also need to, we need to find more hatchets, really. There's probably a load down here, right? Uh, I suppose we better go down here because if he's buried, uh, choose the lettuce this time. Uh, we're not going to start while planting lettuce, so don't. Let's not. Let's not worry about that. Oh, I don't even need to do that. Okay. They're just gonna. They're gonna trust him, but uh, leave him to drown. All right, come on. Awesome, so we got two in there already. Uh, we can also do incubators as well. Once we got the rock crusher going. Hopefully someone grabs this guy before he drowns. Please. Anyone? Anyway. That'd be an annoying way to lose a hatch. Someone? No one no one's interested by the looks of it, so I think he's dead. He is dead. Um, let's just take the meat off the consumables, just in case they try it. Uh, we can put that down here too. Uh, we don't have a chef, do we? It's a bit of a problem. We'll keep the meat for a while. I mean... Yeah, one of these guys will, will give a chef minute but it's already only got some meat so uh not great not a disaster we're on hatch hunt so we need to yeah there's there's a lot of the sandstone biome down here we really need to and i suppose i suppose a better way might be coming down this way 
to. Or just the main the main ladder. We can do that. Mm -hmm. Got a lot of millwood seeds. <laughs> it's uh, not so useful. Sure we got enough I don't think we have seats here. Alright, automation. Now we've done a lot of research. Um do is there anything we desperately need? I don't think there is, so I've got all we can we can do bathrooms, I suppose. Uh, yes, so there's a lot of digging to do up here. We really need to get up up here. Uh, we'll set this to barbecue forever and get rid of those notifications. Uh, iron to iron or copper to copper. Copper or to copper. We only have 100 kilos of copper. Uh, that's not good. Alright, we definitely need to get down here. Uh, and we're going to start running low on food at this point. So, that's going to be another one. Yeah, we've got to keep these guys fed. Okay, but everything, at least for the first 13 cycles, has gone alright. <laughs> it's a... Uh, yeah, that's a thing. Lots of buried items, but I think this is outside of the main biome. Can come across here. I do also like how the saves don't take uh, take two minutes or thirty seconds, like they do on the the all achievement. Oh, they're on the most dupes record run. It takes so long. Cool. So we got the bathrooms, and then we need the water sieve just to make the closed loop. We should probably grab the reservoir too, and we can start feeding some of that into thimble reeds later. We can't plant any thimble reeds yet because they're locavore. So always good not to forget that one. Did that before. Uh, Planted a thimble reed, trying to do locavore, and then went, ah, oh, damn it! Such an easy, easy one to do because it's not a food plant. And um, we can have the the water weed here, so yeah, Leo. I think we can we can use it. I'm not going to plant loads, but there's there's a lot here that's just sitting around. So let's uh, let's grab it and eat it. Uh, no harm in that. Concentration. Yeah, they they are absolutely chunking through the research. Like they could finish this research so quickly. Mm -hmm. Yes, Lyra is on the dig. I don't know why she keeps going down. Can we um, set the in proximity? And thank you for the follow, uh, Star Starshot. And uh, I don't think you've chatted yet, but uh, hello, how? Okay, I think we've only got two. We've still only got two. <laughs> uh, two achievements. So we're not doing super hot right now, but uh, yeah, it's not not a problem. Uh, cool. Yeah. Uh, hopefully that's helpful. We do love a good industrial brick. Yeah. Particularly the hot ones. I, for me, I like doing the hot ones. Cold's good. Hot's better. Uh, pump this up. Uh, have we got anyone we could be a chef? I mean, why, why not? There we go. Doesn't really make sense, but we'll give him a chef. Uh, any tips for a mixed brick with petrol? Well, the, the, that was the third type that I showed, I think. Uh, I definitely showed that in the video, uh, the mixed brick. So in terms of managing the steam and the carbon dioxide levels, that was, that was there. So if there's anything additional, um, you got questions on, let me know. Well, I think I covered that. I hope I did. <laughs> uh, right, let's get some metal refining, I think. Just looking ahead to what we need. Um, yeah, well, slicksters are the only way to deal with the carbon dioxide. That's the thing. If you if you don't use lots of slicksters, then you either have to you you have to delete the carbon dioxide somehow. That they're your only choices, really. So either uh, use a door compressor type idea to delete it, crush it, or um, vented space. Basically, they're your two options. But they make so much carbon dioxide. You have to do it. Uh, let's just sing in here.
Right, okay, we're on cycle 14. Um, unfortunately, I'm going to have to call this fairly shortly. Uh, so what we're going to do, I'm going to just quickly run through uh, run through this cycle and then we'll call it a... Uh, we'll call it a day, unfortunately. Hiya, Angry Sheik, welcome in. Welcome in. Just caught me in the end. Um, yeah, actually, we'll, we'll pick this up, I'm hoping, next week. Uh, I, uh, oh, thank you for fire. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think, yeah, the, I mean, the main focus of this was, was a bit of a test stream, so to make sure my audio settings are working, my, uh, my streaming's working, and I think we're all good, so, that's, uh, yes. Well, um, we'll just round out this cycle, and then we'll, uh, we'll save up, uh, we will get there, we'll have some more time next week to, uh, to play on this, so, Let's just keep rolling. To the end. Um, just need. We've got lots of digging to do. They're not really working on this, which is a bit annoying. I think what I'll do is I'll seven this and six this because they're kind of ignoring this. Bit, and we really do need to get the spawn up. Um, how many critters have we got in here? We've got seven. Okay. Uh, so we also need to um, get going on the next one of these, don't we? So. Uh, so we should take this out and do the same here. We can leave that tile. Or we do need some airflow. Just in preparation. Uh, also, we haven't got any incubators running yet, have we? Yeah, we do need some copper. This problem is trying to focus on all these different priorities. Um, uh, well, yeah. There you go. Uh, uh, is Camille trapped? They're going to try and trap himself. Whereas right, so you can pump the CO2 out of the brick. You can, but the the problem is the amount they make, right? So each generator is making, I've told my head, I think it's 750 grams. Is it 750? Or is that water? 500, right. Yeah, so you need a pump per machine. So you can do it. It's just, yeah, it's a lot. Or not. I mean, sixes are great, so I would definitely recommend. Uh, right, do we take. I think we take another dupe. That's uh, bathroom speed and bladder construction, creativity. I mean, we can do some artwork maybe. Uh, let's give them building. Building's good. And we'll just do carry. Oh, um, yeah, it is a very low, early spawn. I mean, I to be honest, in most runs, I, I'm able to get it up by cycle 30. Uh, what I really want, though, is the. Uh, is the gold. We need the gold amalgam to make the pumps out of. So we need to break our way through here and try not to get any slime on us. Can we do that? There's a little bit there. Do we come in underneath it? Come underneath it. Yeah. Da -da -da. That's it. Yeah, we'll just pop one in. Here we'll use granite. Granite's closer. Grab that and that. Cool, and that. And this should easily be enough gold. Uh, so yeah, we, we need the gold to get the spawn going, so let's do that. And then they're working on digging it out. All good. Um, okay, alright, that's fine. Just thought Camilla trapped herself, she hadn't. Gotta watch these guys. They want to break all the ranches. Yeah, well, I mean, so if you see my um, most used record attempt, Star Shard, then uh, you can see how big the brick is there. <laughs> it's huge. So don't be afraid. Right, awesome. We've got It's Not Raw, so we finally cooked some uh, barbecue. There we go. Third achievement. Just put one in there. We're three out of 33. 200 cycles in one. Yeah, I, that's why I was trying to play on 10 times speed last time. But on 3 times speed, that's uh, probably, what, about 10 hours? It's about 10, 10 hours worth of, or 9 hours, I think it's about 9 hours to do 200 cycles. Uh, and we don't have that time today. Awesome. So, well, we've hit the uh, the end of the cycle. I'm going to wrap that up there. And uh, hopefully I'll see you in the next episode.